Hi everyone, it's Kelly. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a fantastic day. As you saw on the, this picture here, what we are talking about today. Oh my gosh, I did not know that Chanel would drop this collection so quickly. I thought it would be coming, you know, a little bit closer to fall, but it is now sort of sprinkling everywhere. It's Australia has it. And now Singapore has it. I have included the prices as well, just for your reference and information. You can always convert it and just see the approximate prices it's going to be. And let's get into some of this new blushes that Chanel is releasing. I think this is the first of their kind. I don't think that I, Chanel has done a cream to powder kind of blush before. And I will include as much information as I can. So let's Since get straight into it. Since online does not say it's limited edition, so I would assume it's part of their regular col collection. So this is information regarding the Chanel blush. They're, I love Chanel blushes. And I've included here a list of all the ingredients to see if, you know, you're allergic or you're sensitive to something. We are going to get 8 grams in this product. So it's not the oversized. And I will include the five swatches of the five shades that will be coming out. You know, you have pinks and a little bit of a beige and some really interesting and bright color. You will see the swatches and the pictures and coming this up. this is the first blush. This is a very nude blush. To me, I feel like it will be suitable for lighter skin tones. And the name of this shade is called Rose Radiant. It is. It looks like a very beautiful blush. I just think it looks a little bit light. There are some videos of this blushes on YouTube currently as I'm speaking. And some of them, it looks like it's buildable. But the lighter shades, you would have to build a little bit more than if it's a very saturated color to begin with. I am so excited. I love all this color. They all look very wearable, very neutral, and beautiful. And from based on the videos that people have made, it looks like it has a bit of a luminous to it. It's not a full matte. Here is what the shade will look like on somebody with very light skin tone. It looks like it's a very brightening and youthful kind of look, kind of blush. So I love that. And this is a different blush. It looks almost the same as the previous one, but it is a little bit darker from what I have seen. When you put the two pictures side by side, this one is a little bit darker in color. So I love that the, the coloring range includes a lot of skin tones variations. So that is a good thing for many different kind of skin shades out there and here this is the swatch of this up close it's a little bit more peach to me but it's a very neutral from this picture here on this model it looks like she's defined cheeks but you know it's not out there sort of like a makeup no makeup kind of look I really like this shade and this is called beige eclatant so it's a neutral beige kind of color and i love that oh my gosh this is the most exciting color to me this is deep dark burgundy reddish burnt reddish kind of color this is a color that i kind of debating that i really want this color most it's the most interesting color to me because it's totally something different it's called granat profonde it's, it's oh it just looks so beautiful and especially for fall oh my gosh it will look so beautiful and you can definitely use this as an you know eyeshadow too if you want to have your products multitask but this blush will look so beautiful and this is a swatch of it it feels like it's a very like a like a creamy texture it looks like it's very creamy and look at this model oh my gosh it looks so beautiful on her just this tint 
of a reddish purple fuchsia if I might say it just looks so beautiful and now we're getting into the pinks of course there will be a pink when it comes to Chanel blushes they do pink very well and this pink looks like it's a medium pink it looks very beautiful Call, this is called Rose Adult. I would be interested, but I have a lot of pink blushes in my collection already, so I think this is going to be a skip. If I don't already have other pinks, I would definitely pick this. And I know that, you know, not all pinks are the same, but I really don't need like 20 variations of pink. And looking at this model, oh my gosh, it just... This reminds me of that La Beige Spring collection, and the pink is like really this really. Beautiful, youthful kind of look. And this is the other very interesting color to me. It's like this orange, but it's very bright very saturated orange this is the other shade that really intrigued me just based on the color itself so this color is called rouge franc it's this bright reddish orange shade it reminds me of the shadow brushes it looks like that kind of coloring and here's the swatch of it and this is here on a model now on the model it looks like a peachy pink kind of blush but i was hoping for and i was thought that it would be more orange just based on the pictures so i don't know how this will be but based on this picture this will be a pass for me because it's again another peachy pink kind of color so that is the collection or the release anyways of the new Chanel blushes are you interested in any of them or any of the color interesting to you as a Chanel lover myself I will most likely pick something up from every release because it's just so beautiful and of course I will be picking up some from this release I am debating about which one I want. Like just, I just want to get one or two just to get my toes in the game, so to speak. But right now, the one that I'm really interested in is this burgundy kind of color. It's just something different from my collection. I already have, like I said, pinks and corals. And I think I want to skip on those. But this is the most interesting color to me. This one I was really interested but based on the model picture it it's i know lackluster to me so this is my would have been my second choice but i'm gonna pass for now so i'm only gonna be getting maybe one are there any shades that you're interested in getting are you interested in getting any of these let me know down below and until the next video bye everyone